first time we've ever used this kind of technology to show the difference it makes to patients, but also how easy it is to give blood. Often when people give blood, they don't see where the blood donation goes to, but today we've got three examples of patients which have got better through the power of blood donation. So I have a condition, it's called thalassemia major. What that means for me is I don't produce red blood cells. So I'm completely reliant on people going out and donating blood. I was approached by NHS BT. We did a, a lot of campaigning last year to encourage new donors to come forward. And they sold me on this idea of this augmented reality where I would come up on the billboard and then people would virtually donate. And it just takes the fear out of donating. It's a really, really great concept. The way it works is you see the poster and you see a, a blood donor recipient to the poster not looking very well. So the opportunity is for you to interact with that poster and that person in order to donate blood. The way it works is you put a sticker on your arm and through the camera of your phone, through augmented overlay, you can actually see a needle with a tube which goes back up into the poster. And as you start giving blood virtually, the, the blood bag on the screen fills up at the same time the blood recipient gets better in front of your eyes, which demonstrates the power of a blood donation. considering giving blood and haven't done so just yet I would say do it become a superhero save a life my children have still got their mum my husband has still got his wife <laughs> and um, and I'll bring them up and every day um, I know it's because people have donated their time and they've donated their blood so thank you isn't enough it really isn't but thank you